What is up my riders? So I decided to make a video real quick because I haven't been on here in a while. I want to like update you guys on just the stuff going on in the background that you might not know about. First things first, I'm kind of working on the background on things, trying to kind of establish just a business setup because it is getting very, very hard to meet ends like constantly getting enough money on YouTube. So um, I'm still going to be doing YouTube and I haven't actually been live streaming because I'm waiting uh, the 20th. So Tuesday, I will be buying a uh, camera for the PlayStation. So when I actually go on and stream, I'll be able to be face to face with you guys and actually have a camera so you guys can see me because a lot of people have been complaining and they're like, well, why don't you stream with a camera? Well, I physically cannot unless it's for the PlayStation. Like you can't use any other setup. You can't use like a webcam or anything. I could do OBS with like all that money towards it, like getting a capture card and all that. But I think I would rather just do the normal, like the camera looks fine. So I've done that before. I'm going to start doing that again. So the live streams will come back more full force. So that is going to be on its way. Uh, I have been taking a new medicine. So I am taking something that's supposed to like help with my weight and stuff and it's like, kind of depression related uh not really anxiety related more depression um but i really haven't had any anxiety coming off of my antidepressants on paxil i've been off them now for almost like say a month and i actually feel great the first couple weeks sucked but now that i came off them the right way uh, and you guys have seen me probably like relapse three or four times and get back on them uh, i physically can't um, I straight up like did this with the doctor so that I can't get the meds anymore So I won't be able to relapse like physically, but I am taking another med to replace it And on top of that I did it strategically so I did actually come off a lot better of a way I took half of the each pill so I start at 10 I did five for like a week and a half two and a half for another week and a half and then zero. So I actually tapered as long as possible so I didn't get any real side effects. But then on top of that, I started these meds, I'd say like a week and a half, two weeks in. So that has like pretty much helped with all withdrawal and stuff. I'm still getting adjusted to it. I've only been on this for like two weeks now. And my mind's still adjusted, but I just wanted to like make a video because I haven't like been face to face with you guys and everyone's probably been wondering like where I am and stuff. You no, know, we are, pretty close and the uh, like communication from face to face on YouTube. So I'm sorry about that guys, but we will be coming back and we'll be coming back strong. Um, I don't know if you can tell by my face or like my body at all, but I've been losing quite a lot of weight actually doing this. Um, so without Paxil alone, I have gone down three sizes on my stomach and four on my chest. So that's inches. The measurement has gone down. So that's drastic. Um, I've only lost like six pounds, but I've also been lifting really heavy. So I'm hoping that some of it's just muscle that's staying, but that's, that's a good plus too. Um, I feel a lot more motivated and a lot better in general, and I hope it keeps improving. That's kind of why the whole content slowed down a little bit too, but this is kind of just like a major update for you guys with everything going on. I just wanted to let everyone know that I'm still gonna be doing YouTube and I'm still gonna be grinding this out. What I want to do with the majority of my YouTube check because I do want to um, invest some and I might just take money out of my own pocket to do this, but I wanna invest in like a good pressure washer and start trying to do like pressure washing business on the side to make even more money on top of YouTube. But uh, I also want to possibly do more stuff with the car. And I know I've been like contemplating and, and playing with the idea of doing water meth and stuff, giant local to me, not like super close, but not within like it's literally 15 minutes max it would take me to get there so not bad at all i noticed that i'm pretty sure they had e uh it looked like it said e30 which means i'm pretty sure they have like e85 if they have different ones of e um and even if it's just e30 i could literally pump e30 in my car i think i don't know like how that works because e85 is two parts E85, like two gallons to a full tank. I'd have to figure out like the calculations and everything, but even if I have E85 or E30 or, or whatever, as long as it's ethanol, I can mix it in with my car and I can actually do a separate tune with George with my JB4 so that I can make more power with the E. So he would actually be able to turn the boost up with the E85. And I think that is just directly due to the fuel, obviously raising the octane. That'll let me uh, really play more with the boost and stuff. So instead of peaking at 28, I could probably peak at like 30. And that would make a big difference. I could probably gain like 20 horsepower 
uh, from going E85 mix. So uh, it would basically be like an E20, E30 blend. All right, guys, that is pretty much all I wanted to say, but I wanted to make a huge update video and let you guys know. Um, hopefully you guys can comment and interact with this video, like it. I really appreciate all the support that I've been getting with live streams. I just recently have been stopping uh, to wait for the camera and also kind of take a break from it. I play it like here and there, but I don't play it long periods of time. When I stream, it takes a lot out of me because I get super, super angry at the game and I know I need to work on that. Um, and I feel like it's been getting better as I've been getting like happier and adjusting, but I still kind of have like that funky brain dealing with adjusting to the meds and stuff and it just really like gets to me sometimes. I don't want you guys to have to deal with that side. I want to be like happy and like, upbeat when I'm streaming so that I can keep you guys happy and I've just recently not been streaming due to that so I took a little bit of time off with that but uh, like I said uh, camera is coming as soon as I get paid that is already one thing I decided 100% I'm putting towards the live stream so that we can be face to face while I'm streaming and that should be a big deal um, a big improvement and then yeah the E85 on the car is probably the next move I just have to go confirm that and there might be other gas stations I haven't checked yet in the vicinity that has it as well uh, I know it takes a little bit for stations to pick up E85 just because not all cars are performance based and stuff and not everybody wants E85 but if they can get it close to me it makes it very worthwhile because even if I get gas can cans to take it back to my house I have that with me, whereas before I never did it because I didn't want to drive like 30 minutes away every time to get it. 30 minutes up, 30 minutes back, and only have like two five gallon tanks. A lot of uh, research on the corrosion of like the fuel injectors and the gas lines and everything it goes through. And they say that as long as it's under like a 30 blend, if you're not made for flex fuel, like if you're not made for E85, you should be fine. When you start pushing the numbers higher, like a 50-50 blend and stuff, that usually corrodes stuff very, very fast. But uh, you kind of can get away with it if you're just using it as like an octane booster, essentially. So hopefully you guys are excited. Leave comments down below of what you guys want to see next. And hopefully this stuff excites you. Please interact with the video and subscribe if you're new here. More car stuff, more live streaming. I promise you guys. I love you guys. Make sure to be happy. Show says. I'll see you in the next one. I love you.